How you doing everybody? Welcome to Montana Musings with Steve Nelson. Uh, today I'm just at our indoor range um, where we shoot uh, 22 long rifle and mostly in the winter time uh, there's a, a, a rifle league and uh, I used to be in that. Uh, matter of fact right behind me is a, a plaque from uh, 2018 we won the league championship and uh, that was a lot of fun and uh, but I'm getting a little older and a little stiffer and I have a hard time getting in the four position uh, shooting so I decided to take up uh, 22 pistol shooting and uh, but uh, so anyway I was out practicing today and uh, and I thought I'd give you a little look at uh, some of the things that we in the past you know it was quite a bit of, of this uh, shooting going on and uh, of course a lot of the guys were you know out of the military and still like to shoot and and uh, that's kind of a picture of some of the guys from our local town here uh, I wish I knew all of them I don't it's uh, I know one of them was Earl Hofstad and I just uh, don't know all of them there might be a couple of uh, plaques here with some names on them um, some trophies, uh, I think one of them here is, well, like 1959, is uh, that one right there. And it uh, has a Powers, I think it was Dick Kuka, Davini, Hammer, and Chassis. And uh, local folks probably know who they were. Um, but uh, that was before my time here in this little town. But uh, we have a, we have a scoreboard here that we keep track of everybody's scores, um, and and this is our scoring table. And then inside here is where the actual range is. I'll turn the lights on, and you can see down range there. Where you put your targets up and uh, there it's focusing uh, not enough light I don't think but anyway um, yeah this is uh, it's a good facility to have we've uh, gotten some use out of it of course there aren't as many shooters as there used to be and uh, but the kids uh, they still have a youth program and uh, they still work on that here and I don't know how many kids they got this year but uh, it's a lot of fun. It's uh, of course probably a little hard to get ammo right now. So, and of course the target ammo is a little more expensive than regular planking ammo. But uh, just want to do. Uh, and by the way, I shoot a uh, Smith and Wesson 22A, and it's just an entry level uh, pit target pistol. Um, I can show you that. And, uh, but it's a good little it's a good little pistol to get started won't break you up in business you know buying it and getting started in it so um, anyway if you uh, if you like this video um, please like and please subscribe and if you got any comments uh, throw them in there down below and uh, be happy to respond to them but uh, you guys have a good day and thanks from Montana Musings with Steve Nelson